Hey guys, it's Olivia. Today we have the pleasure of opening up a box of food from Home Chef. So here's how it works, guys. You go to homechef.com, put your email address in, and then it'll ask you some questions about what best describes your diet. I chose omnivore because I eat everything. You choose how many people you're gonna be cooking for and how many times a week you plan on cooking. Once you've created an account, you can log in and see the different meals that they offer. Some of them are easy. We'll look at what I ordered, the salmon and the horseradish cream. And here you can see that its difficulty is intermediate, but then it'll also tell you all the ingredients in it and all of the instructions. So you can prepare before it even arrives. And you can read something from the chef. Hello, Nigel Palmer. It's nice to know who created the dish. It makes it feel personal. Up here, it tells you the price per serving, $12.95 per order. I got six meals and it ended up being about $125. It adds up, but it averages to about $6.99 per serving. Everything is recyclable, so I like that. They deliver coast to coast. Sweet. Let's start looking inside. Ooh la la. Oh. Hi, open me for delicious deals. Okay, here I get photos of meals that I ordered. It tells me everything that's in the box. The steak and bacon blue cheese butter. They've given me a binder to put all of my recipes in. I like keeping organized. So these are really good for people who are busy and want to eat healthy, or maybe want to learn how to cook and don't really know where to start. The salmon on top because that's what I'm going to be cooking. It has this cute little bag. It's a Ziploc bag. I love those because you can reuse it. Or I'm not going to reuse this, but. <laughs> We have our asparagus, epicurean butter, my spices, sweet potatoes. And all looks very fresh to me. The one thing I would say, it does contain a lot of plastic. I don't really know what an alternative idea would be. In the box, they separated the meat from the produce. And they've put all of the meat that I have in its own bag. Here are my two pieces of steak. It's very well packaged. Here's my salmon. Mm. It comes with a ton of ice packs and it's still cold. Roasted salmon and horseradish cream. This is the stuff that's going in the salmon. This seems kind of small and it's like, I feel like it's something you can get from McDonald's. Okay, we have our peas in our little plastic container. This is the broth concentrate. All right, let's get ready to cook this. These are some very tiny chives. looking tasty. Ooh, that looks perfect. Salt. Put my potatoes in here. <gasps> I forgot to reserve some of the potato water. Wow, that looks good. I'm gonna try it. Mmm, oh my god. Well, I have to say, both the salmon and the steak came out to be delicious. I felt like I was in a restaurant in my own house. I think it's a nice way to kind of spice it up, if you will, in the kitchen. Learning some new techniques and cooking with some new ingredients you wouldn't necessarily use. Some of these are easier than others. Both the steak and the salmon were considered intermediate. It's not really about it being difficult, it's more about how time consuming it is. Both of these took 40 minutes to an hour to make each. My directions kind of confuse me. 
When I was making the horseradish sauce, I ended up using too much of the mirepoix, which is why it's a little bit red. Still absolutely delicious. And if you've never done a food delivery service before, this was my first time and I was satisfied. I think I will do it again. The only part is it's a little bit expensive. Bye!